What's up guys? I'm Danny with Lanier Lawn Care. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Y'all make sure you hit the thumbs up on this video if you like it. If you have any questions after, feel free to comment down below and I'll answer anything I can. So, today we're going to go over the newest and improved uh, Echo PB8010 blower that everybody has been ranting and raving about. So, uh, let's get into this video, get you some specs, get you some photos of this thing, tell you a little bit about it, and show you it in some action. So, let's get going. guys we're going to jump right into this get you all hyped up for this new blower that echo released we're going to show you a size comparison between it and the 770t we're going to show you the tube comparison between both of them we're going to show you a startup uh, and show you some running of this blower in action and then we're going to go over some uh specs of this thing so let's get going all right guys so jumping right into it here as you can tell the difference between the 770T on the right and the PB8010T on the left. The blower tube is ginormous. It's about twice the size uh, as the 770T and there's a reason for that. We'll get into that soon. Moving on. All right, let's get into the size comparison. Side by side, 770T on the left, the pb 8010 T on the right and you can tell it's significantly much bigger but it also has a bigger gas tank bigger engine at 79.9 cc's this thing is a beast so let's get into startup here and show you some footage of actually using this This is going to be wet grass. This was one morning when it was uh, very wet outside. It was early in the morning, and as you can tell, it stuck to the driveway. But this thing just demolishes it. I mean, just slings it right off like it is nothing. All right, here's some dry grass for you. This is later on that day, and as you can tell, just watch it in action and uh, enjoy <laughs> One thing they've changed is the top handle. Thank goodness because the other one made you want to put tape or something around it. Not on this one. They fixed that. It's comfortable now. Moving on. For the hot days, you still have the fan that blows all the air on your back. And let me tell you, this thing blows a ton of air on your back. Plus, when it gets cold, that also comes with the piece to uh, replace that so it don't blow any air. Now we have the straps. Of course, Echo has great straps on all of their blowers. But, uh, you know, when you compare this to the 770T, these straps are thick 
and very, very comfortable, I have to say. And I really like uh, the way they go around your whole shoulders. As we get into the uh, frame and the fan case housing here, all that's carbon fiber, which is way lighter by about 1.9 pounds. Moving on to the air filter. It's a dual stage air filter. You have your pre-foam filter there, and then you have your regular filter as well, toolless. So you just throw it on there, lock it in place, and uh, you're ready to go. Now, one thing they did keep the same is the handle on this thing. The handle, as you uh, push down, is your cruise control, and then to stop your blower from running, you push it in the up position there, and uh, that's pretty much it. Moving on to the tube. Now, this is where it gets fun because everybody wants to know about this. So, uh, this tube is 91 millimeters thick or wide, shall I say. It is huge. And, uh, you know, there's a reason for that. This thing puts out 211 miles per hour, 1,071 CFM. Yes, I said 1,071 and for all you people that want to know newtons on this thing, it's a whopping 44.4 newtons. All right, guys, so that's going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoy. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below, and I'll do my best to answer anything you have to ask. But I hope this was a great in-depth video to answer majority and most of all the questions that you have or had about this blower if you're looking for a great leaf cleanup clearing large parking lots or stadiums uh, heavy use for eight plus days this thing feels a little very very light on the back guys and uh, you know hey I'm so happy that they came out with this thing because it is truly something that the industry has been wanting for a long time and uh, you know echo answered back and they did not disappoint with this by any means so thanks for watching guys like comment subscribe as always we'll see you in the next one